Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and this week's Hot or Not Saturday. And in today's video I am going to review a brand new brand, for me at least, that is called Like Bunny. <laughs> this is a complete new brand I have never come across this brand before and it's called like bunny and here is their logo type and here is like the invoice from the order and I ordered three pair of leggings two sports bras and one jacket so I have a little bit of everything here and the thing that catched my eye was that their leggings looks very much like lululemon style quality ish so i was very curious to try out and see what kind of quality they have and they have like semi affordable prices all of the items that i have here have like a original price that is crossed over and then they have like a lower price so i don't know if they always have like this kind of sale thing or if it's something just for as for now but i would say the leggings is between like 30 35 dollars the jacket is 45 dollars and the tops are around 30 dollars so it's a little more up there in the price than aliexpress which i usually review but it's a very affordable brand for the kind of quality that you get because that i can say everything that i have from there is very good quality but i'm going to review everything piece by piece and we start with this blue set because this set i have in leggings and two different style of the tops that comes to it and uh, I have the leggings in size medium and I would say they run small in size so I would recommend you to size up size medium fits me perfect but I would never be able to get on a size small uh, and I think even maybe a size large would fit me because as you can see they are kind of tiny but they are very stretchy so that is a good thing and uh, they have high waist with medium tummy control i would say medium compression in the whole leggings and they are cropped so these are not full length but it's this kind of crop that i can get away with they are not cropped right under my knees they are cropped a little bit further down on my calves and that is how i like it if i'm gonna have it cropped and uh, they are very plain and they do have one logo type in like the leg part here which maybe i would have preferred to have the logo type in the back of the leggings here uh, but it's very sleek and plain they are made out of 87 percent polyamide and 13 percent spandex and you can wash them in 30 degrees what i can say with these leggings is that as i said they're on a little bit small in size so they are very tight on me and that is why they tend to give a little bit of camel toe but i think if i would have been sizing up one size more they would not do that to me they are squat proof and i love the waistband because it's this kind of seamless waistband that has nothing that can dig in or anything so i really really like that very much like the lululemon line leggings and i can say overall the material is very smooth and soft and it's very comparable to the lululemon line leggings i would say um they have like a very sudden little v-shape in the back that emphasize the booty a little bit but I mean overall they are very plain but very comfortable and very very good quality I would say and the tops that comes to them are the same kind of color both of them came with paddings but I haven't taken out the paddings in this try on I have the tops both of them in size medium and I would say the tops run more true to size than the leggings so the tops you can go for your normal size but the leggings size up one size this bras the quality is super it's the same kind of soft material than in the leggings and you have this kind of bra that is more like a little like crop top bra that covers a little bit more in the front here and that has like this open back and i found this one to be very cute and here i like the placing of the logo type a little bit better because it's like in the middle in the back of the bra and uh, i would say medium to low support or low to medium support Maybe it's giving more support if you have the paddings in, but I don't like the extra volume that the padding is adding, so that is why I'm taking out the paddings. But I would say on me, like low and medium support without the paddings. Um, I do like that it's covering a lot in the front, it's going like up a lot here in the front, which I really like. And I really, really like this bra and I find it to be very cute with the leggings. The other bra is a bra that is showing a little bit more. I love the open back with this crisscross thing happening and the little mesh part here. 
Uh, it's showing a little more cleavage and it's a little more like open in the front. Here you have the logotype in the front on the side. The same thing here, I would have preferred to have it centered in the back or something. Um, it's no adjustable straps, but I feel like they are very stretchy, so I don't have the problem with... Sometimes these kind of tops can be like too stiff, so they are digging in a lot in my shoulder area and it's giving ache after a few hours or a few minutes. But these ones are very stretchy, so I really like that, so they, it's super comfortable to wear them on. I would say this bra gives medium support and it has a little thickery rubber thing underneath that gives a little extra support. The other one had like the same kind of fabric as the bra all the way down. If I'm going to compare these two bras, this one gives a little more support but shows a little more cleavage and everything. This one is a little more like yoga soft kind of bra. But you can use them to like exercising in the gym if you want to as well. Uh, Overall, I would say I really like this. The bras are $30, no, like $29.99, and these leggings are $32.99. The quality feels super good, and they are so, so, so comfortable. So it's really like something extremely unique. It's nothing that I have been seeing, like, because I find a lot of brands that are like new pop up brands, they have like items that are already been out there like duplicates of things that you find on Aliexpress that they only put their logotype but here I feel like they have unique styles and something completely different so definitely thumbs up for that. I feel like for the price you pay you get so good quality so I definitely think it's worth it and I give it a thumbs up but remember this leggings size up and the bra go for the normal size. So then we have another pair of leggings and these leggings are full length. Uh, it's completely different material but the design is more or less the same. So these are also, maybe not more or less the same, but they are very like similar. These are also having the seamless kind of waistband, so no rubbery thing or anything. And they do not give any muffin top, they are high in the waist. These have the logotype in the middle in the back, which I do prefer. And the same like subtle, very subtle V-shape that emphasizes the booty. Uh, they are long enough in the legs for me and these have a completely different material. They are made out of 87% polyamide and 13% spandex. What was the other? It is the same, but they feel completely different. These blue ones feel more buttery and like... If you have a pair of Lululemon Alliant, it feels more like that kind of soft buttery material. And these feel also soft and stretchy, but a little like stiffer in the material. Not stiffer, but it's a different kind of, not this like buttery touch to them. The same thing here, these run small in size. I have them in size medium, but definitely size up one size because they are a little bit snug on me. So the same thing here, I feel like maybe this kind of designs they have on leggings, they run a little bit smaller in size. They are squat proof and they give good compression and like tummy control and everything. So I really like that. Uh, they are very sweat friendly because of the strata material, they don't show sweat so much and I really like that and it's also drying up very quickly. And they don't move around when I'm walking, even though they are a little bit snug, they are still like staying on place. And they do have this, like in the back here, these two lines that also makes the waist appear a little bit smaller, so it's very flattering. These leggings are $34 and I feel like you get very good quality for the price. This kind of quality is like, this is a pair of leggings that can be a staple in your collection and that will last you a very long time. So I feel like it's like very sleek and good and if you have been eyeballing like Lululemon leggings but you don't want to splur the money, this is like something you can get for less money that feels like it has the same kind of good quality. So definitely thumbs up, I really really like them. So then I have two items left, one pair of leggings and one jacket. And we start with the jacket. This jacket retails for $45 and I have it in size small. It's also made out of 87% polyamide and 13% spandex. And I really like this kind of jacket that you can just throw on top of your crop tops or whatever you're having, like tank top, and then you can take it off after you've been warming up or you can have it just when you go to the gym or from the gym. But I do not like to have this kind of jacket when I'm working out, like during my workout. They are very long in the arms, like long enough for me, and you have the thumb holes that are very good, like quality kind of thumb holes. And this jacket has very cute details, like 
it's a very slim and sleek jacket and you have the logotype in the upper part here and it's centered so I really like that and something that I really like also is that in the zipper in the upper part here you zip it up all the way and then you have like a little flap here that covers the zipper so you cannot like hurt yourself on the zipper it's a very nice detail I really love this color and it's called coral pink and I am so much into this kind of coral pink color at the moment. And the material is super soft and super nice and I would say this one run very true to size. So you can see size small is not even super super tight on me. Uh, so definitely go for the normal size here. There is no need for sizing up or anything like that. I really like this one because of the color, because of the quality. It's the same thing here. This can be like a staple in your collection because I think that this is going to last you a very long time. And the zipper and everything feels like it's very good quality. And something that I also like is that you cannot like see the zipper. It's this kind of zipper that is covering up. So it feels very luxurious if you can see what I mean here, when you zip it up, it's like you don't see the zipper. So I find it hard to find good zippers that I really like. So this one, thumbs, thumbs up. So lastly, we have a pair of black leggings with some details here on the side. And these are made out of a little more like polyester spandex material, I think. I have been cutting out the tag, stupid me. But they feel like a little more like this kind of polyester spandex kind of material, not as buttery, a little more like on the shiny side, but they are not super shiny. I also have this in size medium and these are very true to size I would say because size medium is even maybe a little bit big on me so size small would have been fitting me perfect so there is no need to sizing up in this leggings whatsoever. They are also high in the waist but these have this little rubber thing in the top of the waistband that keeps them up but uh, maybe if you go for a size that is too small it can tend to dig in a little bit. They are squat proof. And I like the details here on the side, a little more like luxurious mesh part on the side here that is not completely see-through, but there is something happening there. I would say they give medium support, not crazy amount of support, and the waistband also gives like medium support. And uh, they are long in the legs, so they are long enough in the legs for me. And these leggings retails for $30, not even that, $28.99, so less than $30. So it's a little cheaper than the other two pair of leggings. I like these leggings. I have nothing bad to say about them, but I just feel like these leggings are not like my favorite. The other two pair has more to give me than this. This is more or less feels like just a normal like pair of leggings that are not doing so much. Um, so I feel like the other two is a better catch if you just want to spend money on one pair of leggings. If it's not specifically this design that is catching your eye and that is how I would recommend. They are very sweat proof and they are good quality. It's just that I feel like this I have seen so many times before. The others are a little more like special unique designs. So, so I give them thumbs up but I feel like the others are a better catch for the money. So yeah guys that is going to be the end of this video. I hope that you liked it and I hope that you like when I'm trying to find a new brand that are affordable like semi-affordable like trying out different kind of activewares and not only AliExpress. So I hope that you liked that and I hope that you are willing to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, of course, I would love for you to hit the little subscribe button so you can be part of my YouTube family here. And with that being said, guys, I hope I will see you in my next video. But for now, we say bye!